Yo, what is going on guys? Hutcher322 here and I am your coach of the Portland Timbers in the All-Star Showdown League. And today guys, I have for you my ASL Season 3 Week... Or season 3? No. Season 5 Week 3 match against Shadow, coach of the PC Barcelona. And you guys did... If you guys did not check out uh, it down below, please go check it out. Uh, like I said, down below. The team builder went up yesterday. Gonna be talking about all my sets. Send on BA. Uh, messaging with Shadow, uh, the coach of the PC Barcelona right about now. Let me get on battle area. Um, and yeah, so I go ahead and break down the team um, in depth. And let's go ahead and make this so it's on draft league mode. And uh, yeah, he'll be sending the challenge in a minute. As you can see, what I'm predicting him to bring on screen. I predict him to bring Victini, Celestila. Jolteon, Araquanid, and Mega Heracross and Togetic. There's other stuff that he can throw in there. There's like Miss Magius, um, Swellows likely, if Poudon is a thing. Um, we get to see my new acquisition Slowbro um, coming into full effect. And uh, yeah, okay, so he's going to send me the team, or send me the challenge. I just want to make sure everything's good, because when I went to playtest with Susie um, a little bit before the game, uh, my Keldeo set wasn't imported, but it's fine now. So without further ado, uh, you know what? Let's just go ahead and hop right into it. I'll, uh, we'll see what he has here. Um, he's going to bring everything that we predict. No Jolteon, no Mega Heracross. Okay, that is, that's actually really good. So he doesn't bring Jolteon, he brings Drudagon instead. I'm okay with that. Um, Drudagon... Tredagon can't really do much to me. At least I don't think. So we'll have Dredagon right there. So he does bring both of his hazard removal. So he was definitely ready for my fortress. He doesn't bring Mega Heracross and bring Swallow instead. Um, let me go ahead and get this fixed on here. And then we'll go ahead and start off the battle. Swallow. Go ahead and move that down there. Alright. Have fun. Okay. So, let's make sure it's sent to the ASL. Um, make sure it's put in the right thing. Okay, it, it is, it is. Okay, so looking at the team that he brought, so like I said, he's definitely ready for my hazards. Um, which is okay. I... I'm, a, I'm really okay with this team that he brought. Keldeo's going to put in the finest once to get it. Eh, Keldeo's kind of iffy in this match. But, um, I see no Jolteon. I see no Hippowdon. I have no reason not to go ahead and lead my Electivire. I think that is my best lead. Let's do it. So he's going to lead out with a Victini. Um, I have this Calc open. And another team. So we have Electivire open here. Um... I want to see what it does against the Victini. I imagine it doesn't do that much. It's actually going to do a lot, but I don't want him to kill me on the first turn of the match. And you know what? Um, do I want to let him know that I'm Scarfed? I don't think I do. I don't think I do. I'm just going to go out into my uh, swap in, which is my slow bro. He's going to go for the U-turn, 25%. Uh, I don't think that's banded. Actually, that might be banded. No, that's just expert belt. Yeah, that's just expert belt. I, I didn't think it was banded. Um, okay, so he's expert belt Victini. We can make a note of that. Uh, actually, wait. No, 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 it's just the set that I had him in on here is weird. Okay, so he might be expert belt. He's definitely... He's definitely a physically offensive Victini. We know that. So he's going to go out and do a Selly here. Um... I want to see if he's like especially offensive like I know I, I'm pretty sure that it can't kill my um, slow bro here I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be living an energy ball max special attack energy ball let's check it yes we do um, I think getting off the yawn is pretty valuable to me so that's what I'm gonna do so he's gonna get the leech seed off we are gonna go for the yawn which is really really good and he has to swap out or his celly is going to sleep here um Personally, uh, the plays that I would make is him, and the only plays that make sense to me is going Araquanid or going Togetic, and I put a tremendous amount of pressure 
on both with my Electivire sets. So what I'm going to go... Okay, so he's going to go into the Togetic. Uh, we make that play proper. And I think I'm just going to Volt Switch. That's probably what I do, right? Doga Dick. Yeah, Thunder Punch if he's physically defensive is not going to be doing all that much. And physically defensive, yeah, it makes a fair amount of sense. Plus, I would like to get momentum. There's no way he stays in here. He actually does stay in. Wow. Um, okay. So you do 39% to him on a crit. That definitely means he's spadef. Uh, what moves is he going to have? I think I'm going to go to Mazard. Yeah, I think I'm going to go to Mazard here. Uh, he probably wishes. I'm going to go Zard here. Oh, he's going to Baton Pass. Hmm, interesting. Okay. Uh, if he goes Araquanid, I'm going straight out into my Fortress and I'm setting up Stealth Rocks. Um, Stealth Rocks pressure his team. He's going to go Dredagon. Okay. Uh, I go Fortress anyways. He's going to go for the Rocks of his own. That's fine. As much as I would want to get my Stealth Rocks up, I think I'm just going to go for the Rapid Spin. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah. I'm just going to Rapid Spin. He's going to go Steela. Which is fine. Um, I can go hard Charizard here. Because what is he going to do? He's going to click Fire Blast. That's all he's going to do. So it's like, I don't, I don't think he makes any other play. And even if, even, even so, Charizard should eat this up. Okay, he's gonna lead seed, but we're gonna put on a lot of pressure here. And I think I'm gonna Mega Evolve and click the Air Slash. I think that's my play, cause I don't, I don't see him swapping, or I don't see him staying in. But don't I just hit this? The, Togetic almost dies. Well, actually, he's Spadef, so no, that's not true. But. Oh my god, we just do so much damage. Actually, just do so much damage. And we'll just go for the flamethrower. Play it safe here. Um, we're gonna just we're just gonna Oka the uh, Selly. I oh, I would doubt that that matters. Um, Celestila, Spadef, uh, Spadef. The the roll is still in my favor to kill. So I'm going to doubt that that matters. We're going to get rid of the Selly. He was predicting me to overpredict, so I'm glad that I uh, did not overpredict. Stat Shadow kind of knows my play style. He's, he's played me a fair amount, so I'm not surprised that he made that play, honestly. Um, let's drag this stuff over here. <sighs> okay, so I, I forget to open my notes um, <laughs> before I do this stuff. But Zard is going to claim his first kill of the season. He has to be... Spadef. Ah, uh, nah, I'm not going to, I'm not going to comment. I'm not going to comment. Uh, I don't want him to get anything on my set. So Charizard kills... Selly with Flamethrower. And that's a huge kill. What do I want to go on this drug I think I'm just going to go to my fortress. Like, if he reveals the fire punch, like, cool. Uh. Uh. Or do I just go to my slow bro? Um. Can I set up. I can set up hazards on the. Or Aquanid. So I'm going to go slow bro, play it safe if he has the fire punch. He has the Dragon Tail, okay. He goes, he brings me into Keldeo. Interesting. Okay. That's a common move on this, uh, Dratagon. Just a little bit interesting that he has it, you know. Gotta fill this thing out. Um, Icy Wind will two-shot him, possibly, if he's defensive. It's gonna do good damage. Um, and he's not gonna do all that much to me. I don't think Keldeo's usefulness is that high in this match. Really, all it's going to outspeed is the Victini. If he goes Togetic, my, the Icy Wind is the play anyway. So I'm just going to Icy Wind. Oh my god, all these crits. Oh, I'm sorry, Shadow. I'm really sorry, dude. 
I'm really sorry for all these crits, dude. I actually feel bad. I'm critting the life out of him. Um, I just asked you in again. Because I'm going to be 2 KOing. I'll 2 KO from this range. Then whatever he goes into slows down. Unless, I think he's going to go Araquanid here. I can 2 KO the Araquanid if I click Stone Edge here. Huh. Is that a play that I want to make at this point? Is that a play that I need to make? No, cause no, cause I don't want to kill the Araquanid, cause I want to set up hazards on it. I'm icy winding. I invite you to go to the Araquanid because Fortress walls it. Plus, I can get Rocky Helmet damage off if he tries to attack me. We're in a good position right now. Um, I want to limit the amount of turns that I bring in my Zard because that Victini is looking oh so scary. I do have my Slowbro for it. I don't want to take that thing on in the sun, though. I will tell you that much. I don't want to take it on in the sun. Um, like I said, he could swap out here. Um, he will be to it killed with this Icy Wind from this point. Um, two will pick up the kill, so he's only going to be able to get one hit off on me. And he might have the Glare, which is a play that he might go for. I will still outspeed him afterwards because I will have halved his speed. As long as I don't get full paired, we'll be good. But yeah, I don't think Keldeo is all that uh, useful anyways. Because I can still um, outspeed the Victini with my Electivire. And uh, yeah. I'm pretty sure he's not Scarfed. There's a chance that he's Scarfed. Scarf doesn't make all that much sense in my opinion though. He needs to be able to swap up his moves. So he's taking a little bit of time uh, to make his decision. But yeah, we're looking good right now. Ex er, uh, Electivire is looking like a enormous threat to him i'm very glad that i brought that thing and especially if this dragon is gone just electivire is gonna run house on him and like every time one of my mons dies i just get to go electivire and actually probably claim a kill or get a lot of momentum so we'll see what he goes for here again he could dragon tail he could glare me he could make a prediction outrage i mean He's defensive. He's shown rocks and dragon tail. That screams defensive. I, there is actually no way for him to kill me if he's defensive. Uh, we're gonna get. Oh my god, these crits, dude. Oh, these crits. I actually feel so bad. It doesn't matter. I would have killed either way. I actually just feel so bad, dude. That really sucks. Um. I mean, I outspeed him anyways. Um, he has to be max speed to actually outspeed me here. I, I feel so bad, dude. But I'm just going to go for a safe sludge bomb. He's going to go out into his rare Aquanid. Um, thank you. I don't want the poison. I actually feel so bad right now for Shadow. Um, so Moongus to the Araquanid. I just want to see if it's uh, Assault Vest. That's all I want to see. I want to see if it's Assault Vest, then we're going right on Fortress. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, there's a chance that he's offensive assault vest. All right, we're gonna go fortress here. Uh, he's gonna stockpile. Okay. Um, we're getting right out of here. I think I'm leaving immediately. I am leaving immediately. Goodbye. Um, I think I just go to my slow bro and yawn this thing. Um, this is a problem. This is a real problem. Um. Oh lord, he's brought this set so many times. It's really hard to deal with though. Um, I mean, Leech Slate doesn't do anything to me, because I know he's not banded, so even Adamant Leech Slate, I can take two, and I get the Yawn off. After I get the Yawn off, I go out into Electivire. I gotta think about this. 
Electivire. Thunder Punch should 2 KO him. Even if he's minus 2. Actually, I'm just going to do it now. Like, I know how much pressure this thing puts on. But this plus Keldeo might kill it. Uh, it's close. I don't even know. I'm actually going to Volt Switch. I'm going to Volt Switch out into Slowbro. He's going to Liquidation me. He's going to get the defense drop, which is huge, but now I go Fortress, predicting the Leech life. He Liquidations again. He's going to get the, another defense drop. That's annoying. Oh my god, dude. This is fair, but like, come on. I think I just have to keep doubling. Actually, no. I'm going to yawn. This thing needs to go to sleep. Then we go Fortress. Which we eat it up. Which is fantastic. I think I have to Volt Switch into Electivire. I... No, I, I need rocks. I need rocks. Uh, he's gonna liquidate me. Okay. God, this thing is a problem. Nope, nope. Net doesn't die. Fortress. Uh, he's brought this set so much. It's so hard to deal with, though. Raquinid. Kill. Er. Fortress. Dies to Araquinid. Quinid with Liquid Asian. Okay, so Fortress did nothing of what I wanted it to do this week. Oh, this puts me in a really bad spot. So I know he has rest. Liquidation is his only attack. I think I just need to go Electivire and hope. I mean, I can kill it afterwards. Like, Electivire puts in so much work, but this just means that I need to save Keldeo for the Victini. I can still win this. I can still win this. This is 100% winnable. By all means. So I'm just gonna Thunder Punch him. Big damage. Please don't roll the Liquidation. Please, please. Oh, thank you, dude. Thank you so much, thank you so much. We should kill this thing now. Please. Please kill. This is my only play. Please kill. Come on, Electivire. Please kill. If we don't kill, as long as he doesn't click rest, we're fine. If he clicks rest, then we're kind of... We're kind of just playing the sleep talk game. This needs to kill. I want to look at Electivire, what the roll is. So I think he's max HP. He has max HP. At plus three, this guaranteed kills. This guaranteed kills him if he is just max HP. It does 33.5% min. Okay, we should be okay. I really wanted rocks up in this game, but killing this Araquanid is the top priority at this point. Okay, he's going to go Dredagon, stack it off. We're going to get rid of this thing. Get rid of the Dredagon. Or, or, yeah, the Dredagon. Okay. It's this one, right? Yep. Okay, so he goes Victini. Electivire. Um, Electivire kills Dredagon with Thunder Punch. Oh, I wish I had rocks up right now. I think I just have to go slow, bro. It's my play. If he makes the bolt strike play, just good on you. He's gonna Zen headbutt. Okay, that's really, really good. Does Scald plus Psyshock kill him? I'm 
talking about the Araquanid. Okay, he's not plus three anymore. Cross that off. Well, I don't think he stays in. Why would you stay in? I'm gonna side shock. He goes to Getic. Okay. Fair. I'm just gonna sit here and side shock. Crit. Cool. What else is new? I don't think it's time to go into Mazard. Actually, when else would I go into Mazard? Let's go Zard now. He's gonna toxic me. Flamethrower should do a lot. To get it. Flamethrower. In the sun, if he's spadef, he's gonna live it. What if I get to plus one? I think he's gonna roost here. <sighs> this is a tough play. I'm gonna work up. I think I'm gonna work up. I don't know. Yeah, I'm gonna work up. I don't think he can touch me. Roost, okay. So we flamethrower here. Doing big damage to this thing. Oh dude, this is this is gonna come down to the wire, I feel. I think it actually comes down to how many switch ins does Electivire have. That's going to be very, <clears throat> it's going to be very determined on how this is going to go. We're going to do loads of damage. He's going to roost. Sixty-seven. That was like a really high roll. Screw it. Flamethrower again. <clears throat> Sorry, my voice is feeling a little scratchy. But our Zard is going to go down, um... Not much I could do to prevent that. I wanted to spin. I just couldn't. Uh, this is tough. Zard dies to Togetic with toxic damage. I think I just go Amoongus. Yeah, I think I need to go Amoongus here. Let's get some Sludge Bomb, sludge bomb damage off. Please don't go Araquanid. He goes Araquanid. Okay. There's one. Okay. I need to go... I'm going to go Keldeo. That's my best play. He just stays sleeping. Uh, fairly certain I have to stone edge here. We're we are gonna land it. That's oh my god, Keldeo. Oh, that's huge, dude. That's actually huge that we just landed that. I'm definitely keeping Keldeo around. Keldeo kills Araquanid with Stone Edge. I don't think you guys understand. <clears throat> How much of a kill that is, because... Oh, dude. And we have our wall core intact. Okay. We can probably come out of this alive. And Electivire... Electivire is not as healthy as I'd like it to be. But it should be okay. I don't think Dazzling Gleam does that much to me, does it? I don't think Keldeo can break through this. No, it can't. Eh, we can maybe two shot. There's a chance that we can two shot it. Depends on what he clicks, but Dazzling Gleam's gonna do a load to me. 
And I might not get a stealth rock swap in if I do that. I'm gonna go Moongus. If he goes Victini, then good play. But I, I can't have my Slowbro toxic. I can't have it toxic. That's not how we're gonna play this game. <sighs> like I said, Victini is super scary. I don't think Keldeo picks it off. Oh no, Keldeo does. Keldeo one shots it. Oh, okay. I'm just underestimating, underestimating Keldeo. I'm sorry, little Sebastian. I underestimated you. Man, if I had Lycanroc, Lycanroc would have just destroyed this game. It actually would have 6 0 him. <laughs> Banded Lycanroc 2 at KOs his entire team. Lamau. You know, unless that, uh. Unless that Sally was like very physically defensive. He's gonna go into his Swellow. Ooh, he's Flame Orb. Okay. That means. I think Slowbro still eats. I don't see a world where Slowbro doesn't eat. And if it doesn't eat, I have to sack my Amoongus. Um, he's got to run Jolly. Flame Orb. Guts. Raper. Yep. Amoongus can take the hits. Er, Slowbro. Guts Flame Orb does 44 max. So he has to get two max rolls. Oh, I didn't even uh, factor in Facade. I'm just gonna... I think I gotta sack my Moongus. Uh, yeah, I have to sack my Moongus. And then I probably go Electivire. <sighs> I gotta think about this. Now goes my Moongus. If he has Quick Attack, if he has Quick Attack, I think he wins. I'll be honest, I think he wins if he has Quick Attack. I don't think Electivire w lives it. Uh, I played around that Araquanid horribly and it's gonna absolutely cost me here. If he has Quick Attack, it does kill us. Okay. Facade. The slow bro. The slow bro even kill? Slow bro doesn't kill. My play is Electivire. Uh, dude, this sucks. If he if he has quick attack, he wins the game. If he has quick attack, props to him. Yep, Thunder Punch is the most damaging move. Uh, please don't have quick attack. 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 Please, please, please don't have quick attack. Please don't have quick attack. Come on, please, 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 please. This is legitimately what the game comes down to. It legitimately comes down to the fact whether he has quick attack or not. Because I'd imagine Electivire kills. Yeah, Electivire 100% kills. Actually, I Volt Switch. Yeah, I Volt Switch. Oh, please kill, dude. Er, please, please don't kill me. <sighs> Quick Attack wins in the game. It all depends if he has it. He doesn't have it. Oh my god, he doesn't have it. Boys, we're in business. He doesn't have it. But then Thunder Punch would have been the best play. I'm gonna yawn. I'm gonna scald. Okay, so we do good damage. 
I'm pretty sure I live, don't I? He's at 48. I need to think about this. Okay. So 65. What did Facade do to me earlier? 49. Okay, so I, I guarantee take this. I guarantee take this and can kill. Question. Does elect... The thing is, if I make this play, I'm basically telling myself I think I'm going to slack off. If I make this play, I'm telling myself the Victini isn't scarfed. God, this is such a close game. I don't know what to go for, guys. I don't know. It's a 50-50. It legitimately comes down to whether Victini is scarfed or not. Actually, I'm going to Scald. Okay, he goes to Getic. We don't get the burn. I'm going to go aggressive into my Electivire. Is that the right play? I don't know. Yeah, that's the right play. He's gonna roost, okay. We thunder punch here. We get literally as much damage as we can. <sighs> Dude, this is, oh my God. Regardless of the outcome, this has been a fantastic game. We're gonna get tons of damage on this thing. He is gonna go for the toxic. I get two hits off. We get rid of Togetic, okay. We force in Victini. I don't know if that was the right move. I guess we're about to find out. Meteor dies to Swallow with Facade. Electivire kills Togetic with Thunder Punch. <sighs> dude, 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 dude. I don't even know at this point, dude. Slowbro lives the hits. <sighs> if he scarfed Victini. If he's Scarf Victini, I'll know. Oh, scarfed. Scarfed. <gasps> he went Swallow. Oh, he has Quick Attack. Okay. Okay. The game comes down to whether he's Scarfed. I Scald regardless. Oh, <gasps> he went Victini! Oh my god. He's not scarfed. Wait, Electivire went down. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, that was a good play. I think I lose. I think Swellow wins it. Unless he... I think Swallow wins it for him. I think we're going to take our first L of the season. Electivire dies to... Togetic with poison. Damage. Like, I can kill Victini. Uh, my best play is sacking Keldeo. That's honestly my best play. Because Keldeo can't outspeed the Swallow. I hope he's Z moving and I hope he burns it now. Unless he royally screws this up. No, he's gonna bolt strike me, so we die. Um, Slowbro is gonna have to live. 
I don't know. I think it's over. We're gonna scald. Uh, yep, we lose. Unless he's gonna get like a min roll here. Uh, I'll check the calc, dude. I don't. <sighs> I'll check the calc. I don't know. Let's see. Let's see the facade calc. Last time he did 49 to us. Facade is a roll. It is a roll to kill me. And he picks up the win. We're gonna fall. <sighs> and we are gonna fall 1 0. We are gonna fall 1 0. That one stings. That is a match that I thought I was gonna win. Where did I go wrong? The, the Araquanid. Yeah, the Araquanid lost me the game. Well, GG's to Shadow. Um, yeah, well played. I, I, I... Wow. I can't believe I just lost that game. Shadow played phenomenally. What can I say? You've played absolutely fantastically. Um, GG's. Uh, yeah. Uh, this one hurts. Alright, well, see you guys later. I'll see you guys in the next one, and goodbye.